Hi guys, welcome to the Marshall online demo for this, the Marshall DSL 15C, which is a 15 watt valve powered combo available at Marshall dealers now. What I'm gonna do is take you through uh, the front panel features as always, then check out some of the sounds that you can get from the DSL 15C. Checking out the front panel left to right, first you've got your clean channel, which consists of gain and volume, followed by your channel selection switch. Green LED means you're on clean, red LED means you're on overdrive. The overdrive channel itself consists again of gain and volume. Then you've got your EQ section, which is made up of treble, metal and bass, presence two and reverb on the end. You've also got the classic DSL switches in there, which consist of tone shift and deep. We'll get to them in a little while, see how they sound and what they do. Starting with some sounds though, firstly the clean channel. You can see I've got my EQ set on about eight as always. And um, yeah, this is the clean channel with the volume on uh, seven and the gain on half, five. <laughs> On the back pickup of the guitar. What I'm gonna do now is drive the gain up slightly to about three quarters so you can see how it breaks up. It breaks up in true uh, Marshall tradition. Then onto the overdrive channel itself, I've got the volume set on about five and the gain set on two. Now there's a lot of overdrive in the overdrive channel as you'll hear now. And now taking that gain up to about halfway. And to give you an idea of how much gain there is, this is it on nearly full. All right, so that's a look at the two main sounds in there, but also we've got these, uh, these switches in there. Firstly, the tone shift button. If you're familiar with the previous DSL range, you'll know that the tone shift is basically a mid scoop. So when you engage the tone shift button, it takes all the mids out, good for heavier riffs and stuff like that. So I'm gonna take the gain of the overdrive channel up to about half again and engage the tone shift so you can hear the difference. <laughs> Thank you. 
and without the tone shift again. And then we've got the deep switch as well. So everything you've heard so far has had the deep switch engaged, which gives that, that sort of classic DSL bottom end to it. So by removing the deep switch now on the overdrive channel, you get this kind of thing. And to give you an idea of what the deep switch does on the clean channel, this is back on the clean channel with the gain on half, and this is with the deep switch engaged again. Now without the deep switch, with all right and last off the reverb I've had the reverb set on about number three for the whole demo and just to give you an idea of how much reverb there is in here I'm going to now take it up to around number seven and then reverb all the way up to maximum. All right, one last thing on the DSL 15 is the Pento Triad switch on the rear panel, which is a switch which takes it down to half power. And um, to give you an idea of what it does, if we go back to the overdrive channel, And now switching over to Trio. Not only is that switch good for if you want to be able to drive the amp at lower volumes, etc., but for the character of sound, it, it sort of changes as well. So that's pretty much it. We'll take a quick look at the rear panel, but that, in a nutshell, is the Marshall DSL 15C. On the rear panel, the Marshall DSL 15C, first of all, you've got your Pento triode switch, followed by your foot switch input, and then you've got your speaker outputs. For more information on this amp and others in the Marshall DSL range, visit your local Marshall dealer. Thank you.